I finished high school in the year 2004 at the age of 17 and the next thing was to get to the university. Being the great student I was, I wanted to go to one of the best universities in my country but my family members wouldn't let me. Some said that I was not good enough. Others said since I was sickly boy, traveling a long distance away from home could be dangerous. Anyways, I ended up in a polytechnic but after three years in the polytechnic, I decided that I was never going to continue with anything called schooling. Even though everyone I know hates that idea because in my country, a degree is like a god. But in today's video, I'm going to be sharing with you something better and more valuable than degrees and none of them is a secret. If you're new here, consider subscribing so that you won't miss other interesting videos like this. Why is university so overrated? Almost everywhere in the world, schools and universities are overrated. Not because these institutions give education. Yes, it's not because of education but because of the degrees. Let's get it right. The honor and worship school gets it isn't because it's the source of education. Instead, it's because that's the place that has been accredited to issue the decorated paper called certificate. If you argue with this assumption, I'll ask you to close your eyes and imagine that schools and universities stop giving certificates or degrees. What do you think will happen? If you're asked to go to a university but there wouldn't be any degree after all, education is what you need, right? Since education is what you need and it doesn't leave inside a paper, why can't you go to a university and get that education without having any paper to show for it? Now, you can see what I'm talking about. Nobody would go to university if the university doesn't give degrees. So, the only reason why the university is overrated is because of its degrees, period. Now, is a degree important? Yes, for few percent of us, maybe for five or ten percent of people. If you want to be a medical doctor, a lawyer or anything like that, yes, the degree is important. But for most of us, education, not a degree, is the most important thing. Imagine you want to be a computer engineer, a software engineer, a writer, a musician, a salesperson, a journalist, an inventor, scientist or an entrepreneur. Yes, many people and organizations will never give you a chance to do any of the above work except entrepreneurship without a degree. But it's because those organizations are dumb or deceived by the school system. Nobody needs a degree to be a salesperson. Nobody needs a degree to be an inventor. Nobody needs a degree to be a musician, writer or even a scientist, journalist. Yes, CNN may never employ you without a degree but that will show how dumb they are because journalism like every other thing is a skill. All you need to be a good journalist is education and practice. Why do you think the university is the best place or the only place to get education? Yes, if you don't have a degree as an inventor or scientist, the science community will not recognize you today because we're dumb. We're dumb to have thought of degrees is what makes someone a scientist while the forefathers of science had no degrees. Curiosity, curiosity, curiosity is the mother of education, skills and human progress. Now that I've made this clear that this video is not for everyone, let me speak to many people out there whose need is education and not a degree. Google. Everybody knows it and everybody uses it but do you understand and appreciate what Google means? You see, when I was growing up in my little town, I would go to the cyber cafe to buy cheap browsing time which will be overnight because there was no internet as common as we have it today. I would be in the cyber cafe all night simply reading from Google. It was gold for me and I appreciate it. Now, let me ask you, what is the foundation of education? Very simple. The foundation of education is not the uniform we wear to school nor is it the test or even degrees. The foundation of education is information, period. If I can get enough information about my field, be it law, medicine, accounting or entrepreneurship, I can get an education in that field. Google gives you information without you having to pay an unreasonable amount of money to get it. Google literally changed my life because through that simple app, I've been able to learn valuable things that have been the reason for my success. I know you have a Google app or browser on your phone. What I don't know is whether you're using it to get education or entertainment. Believe me, Google search gives to all of us what no university can give us. YouTube. Whenever I tell people that I don't like social media, they are quick to remind me that YouTube is a social media but I don't get it. What is the definition of social media? Is anything social media because we define it as such? 
To me, YouTube is a university, and even better than any university. This is what happens. YouTube has a crazy algorithm which studies what you consume on YouTube. If, for instance, you come to YouTube every day to watch cat videos, YouTube will give you more cat and dog videos. If you consume entertainment, news and games on YouTube, you'll get to see more of such things. But let's say you consume educational videos in any field – science, art, history or entrepreneurship – then whenever you log into your YouTube app, you'll see more and more videos in that field. This way, YouTube becomes one of the most valuable libraries in the world. Podcast Many years ago, I read or heard Brian Tracy saying something like, if you listen to audio training programs in your car, you can consume the equivalent of the university degree information in two years. Fortunately for us, we don't have to be in the car to listen to podcasts anymore. With a simple app on your phone, you can learn wonderful things that can change your life. Do I honestly think that the three apps mentioned in this video are more valuable than a university degree? To answer your question, I'd like to ask you, what is education? To me, education is about information and practice. If I can get information about any field, I can practice and improve my skills and if I can practice, I can do anything in that field. If you agree with me that information is the foundation of education, then you should agree with me that information has been democratic. If in the 21st century, you think that you need to go to a university to learn how to be a salesperson, how to be a writer, how to be a software engineer, an inventor or an entrepreneur, well, I don't know what you know. The reason for this video Because the school has become a god in our world today, whenever anyone seems to be speaking against the school, such a person should be expecting several attacks. I'm a gentle person and I don't have the strength for your weapon, so save it. This video is not to speak against the school or your degrees. If you think you need degrees, you need it. If you think you can get all the education you need using the internet, you're right. If you like this video and you want to subscribe to educative YouTube channels, then you will enjoy our other channels which are about stories and biographies of some of the most successful people in the world. We call it Fame TV. Look at the description box to join the Fame TV. We love you.